Let's write the name for Hg2Cl2. So first off, mercury, Hg, that's a metal. It's a transition metal. Chlorine, that's a nonmetal. So we have a metal and a nonmetal. We'll name this as an ionic compound. Let's first write the name for Hg as it appears on the periodic table. That's mercury. Next, we'll write the name for Cl, chlorine, lowercase c. And then since we have this ionic compound, we're going to cross out the INE and have IDE. And so far, we have the name mercury chloride for Hg2Cl2. But again, mercury, that's a transition metal. We know that chlorine will have a 1 minus ionic charge. So we have two of them, 2 times 1 minus, that's 2 minus. So the mercury, that has to be a plus 1. 2 times the plus 1, that'll balance out the 2 times the minus 1 here. So the net charge is 0. Because of that, this right here, we write Roman numeral 1 between the names. So the correct name for Hg2Cl2 is mercury 1 chloride. We should note that the mercury 1 ion is Hg2 2 plus. So each one of these is going to have a 1 plus charge. But the whole thing, it stays together, kind of like a polyatomic ion. That doesn't matter too much as we're trying to name Hg2Cl2, but you should be aware of it. the mercury 1 ion. This is the mercury 1 ion. This is Dr. B with the name for Hg2Cl2. It's mercury 1 chloride. Thanks for watching.